Hello everyone, it's DA here. Hope you guys are doing great. Hope you are doing amazing. Today I just want to talk about the future of raids and in-game content in Warframe and where I see them all going in the future because let's be honest, the evidence is all there and it's right in front of our noses. Now if you are new to Warframe, the raid system was the way players used to acquire arcanes in the game and this also was the way they are able to meet several levels of difficulty and challenges. Raids were the end game content that hardcore players love, but of course you have a lot of people who don't like the raid system. Now DE removed all the raids because it was too buggy and they felt like they need to redesign the raid system before bringing it back into the game. So what will the new raid system be in Warframe and when are they bringing it back? This is one of the biggest questions a lot of us will ask every single time and even during Death Stream and they always pass on those questions. Well, I want you guys to take note of this so you can come back and say, you know what DA, on this particular day, you were 100% right. Now I began to notice that DE decided that they were done with the current raid system when they started flushing out the open world content. Now this is crazy, but that is exactly when it started. As soon as they were able to finalize that Venus is around the corner, they decided, you know what, we have to take away and remove the raid system. They are still planning on expanding Place of Eidolon, we already have Venus on the way, and they will also be working on a massive sentient outpost, and they even confirmed that when Venus is done, they will work on another planet. Now it's just so coincidental that DE decided to finally remove the raid system when all those expansions are coming out. Now my belief is that DE is trying to introduce a new arc to their mission development. They already spoke about the Kingpin system and I think that might also have a part in all of this. They want to base and set the new raid system in an open world they create. Basically something we see in the plains of Eidolon or something we see in Venus or maybe probably the sentient outpost or a different planet. Events like Plague Star is a test to that system and I believe that it is and they are also fine tuning it to the point where it becomes better every single time Plague Star returns. Now I see DE is trying to develop bosses like how games like Guild Wars 2 or games like World of Warcraft build theirs and that is not even a bad thing at all. Even with the dungeon system, we can see the evolution of that in Warframe as well. I don't know about you guys, but I would love to see an all out battle, an all out open world battle and fight against a giant boss. Now we have the spiders to start things off on Venus because of course they have confirmed that those will be some of the main enemies that we will be fighting. And of course we have the giant flying Eidolon coming to Earth. If I'm correct, that will be our new raid boss on Earth. And of course, this one in particular, don't take my word for it, but it is a possibility. They said it's going to be like three times larger than the size of the Hydralis, so it's going to be massive. Plus, this thing is going to be able to fly, so that is crazy. Now, if you guys also remember when DE removed Dark Sector battles from the game a few years ago, they often bring things back with a different formula, and I think the only sense of challenge in the game right now is the extended survival runs or the sanctuary runs, which is what they brought back to replace Dark Sector. So that is one of the reasons why I think if DE will bring the raids back, they will probably switch it up and bring it back with something different. And I don't see sanctuary runs or survival runs as end game content in the game right now. This is also why I think it's going to be the massive open worlds and the sentient outpost could be the next venue for raids in Warframe as well. Now with all that said, the biggest problem DE still has is going to be the reward system. Don't have me fighting for several minutes or a whole hour only to give me mediocre rewards because that is really frustrating when you see that in the game. DE will have to back that end game content with some really sweet rewards. Right now there are no end game except fashion frame and of course some people have different opinions about that. And Eidolon hunts are not even hard enough for a lot of people so raids will be the way to go. Raids used to have 8 people divided into 2 squads and I really miss that type of gameplay within the system. But let me know what you guys think about this, do you think just as I do, that the raid system will return in an all out open world state, and that DE is trying to create a more traditional style of play. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Thank you very much for watching, hope you enjoyed this, I'll see you in the next one.